Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to The Walking Dead, the final season. We are back. Long it's been. And we're putting together a battle plan. Changed. So let's head into the greenhouse where apparently it's pretty dangerous. You're gonna stand there sulking all day? You're gonna do something useful. Well, we need that barbed wire. There must be another way in. Still being hostile, I see. He's gonna have to get over it at some point. So here we go then. Collectibles can be found in the world. So I guess now we can find collectibles, which we couldn't before. I'm guessing. Right, find a way in. Uh, also, if you're new to the channel and you love point and click adventure games or anything by Telltale Games, make sure you hit that subscribe button to become part of our little point and click family. And join us on our adventures. As we pick up this boar skull. That's Wild pretty cool. Boar. Not too many in these parts, but... They were more common where I grew up. I used to hunt them with my old man when I was little. They make terrible noises when they die. I like it. Yeah, I bet. It'll look good on my wall. Well, provided we don't get kicked out by them again. Which is what happened last time. Uh, let's talk to Ruby then. Are you okay? It's been so long since I was here. I used to love this place. But it's so overgrown. I'll be fine. Let's just find a way in. Seriously, how did this place get this overgrown? I don't really understand what happened here. I guess they had more people at one stage, but for it to get like this is pretty crazy. What do you want? Uh, nothing. For you to stop being a jerk? We're desperate, you know, so don't get comfy. If we survive these raiders, you and I are gonna have words. Let's survive first. Ooh, words. I'm so scared. Right, let's inspect this glass. Can we see anything Fancy through here? Shit. Well, there's too much condensation on the inside. Condensation? That's a big word for you. Shut up. Oh, burn! That's right. Put him in his place. Needs to be brought down a level or two, I think. Uh, right, so there's this ladder... I don't know if that's what we're supposed to do, but I don't really see any other options, so... It looks like the ladder is pretty much all we can do here. Let's hope it doesn't collapse. That window. I bet we can get in there. Good spot. Mitch, come here and give me a boost. Wait. Make her go first. We send the one we don't mind losing. That's Ooh. an ugly thing to say. You first, Mitch. No. See, because the people back home want me to survive this little trip. Let's just yeah, get do the they? stuff we need, okay? Just go. Holler if one grabs you. Otherwise, we'll come as soon as you get the all clear. I guess we'll know when the door opens. Seriously, how did it get full of walkers, though? That's what I don't understand. Uh, I mean, it looks pretty clear. Unless they're hiding in the plants. Right, there's one over there. Well, there's quite a few in here, actually. What did they do? Just lock them in? Right, there's a knife there. Yeah, we're fine. Just gonna use this knife. Whoa! That one came out of nowhere. Stop. Any more? Yep, there's more. Alright, two. Uh, okay, we should be able to hopefully do the old thing stab stab. If Clem hurries up. There we go. Bye bye. I think that was it, wasn't it? I didn't see any others. I would probably just walk around the area first, just to make sure there weren't any others hiding. But whatever. Oh, <laughs> the eye. Not bad. Oh, now he's got compliments for us, has he? Oh, look. Oh, now he's done his little Wild look away. Ginger. 
Eastern prickly pear, Jerusalem artichoke, false Solomon seal. Let's find that barbed wire and anything else that might be useful. All right. Uh, there's a mushroom <laughs> which we can pick. You seem happy. You can only eat the same bland rabbit stew so many times before you go crazy. These herbs are going to do wonders for morale. You wait and see. How did these things get watered for all this time? Like, seriously? <laughs> uh, what have we got here? There's a shovel. Could be a weapon. Or use it to dig a grave. All right, Mr. Optimist, Optimist the over there. Jeez. We had to use cups and bowls. Took forever. Yeah, I'd imagine it did, but come on. Let's have a little bit of optimism here, shall we? A pry bar, that might be useful. For smacking that guy over the head. We're not going to do that, don't worry. We're good people. Uh, I want to go to the barbed wire last. Yes! Dibs! Fine. I've got the pry bar anyway. Uh, right, let's talk to Mitch. Did you find anything? What do you think? Okay, just asking. You know, the barbed wire idea is smart, I'll give you that. Those assholes try and climb our walls, they'll tear their guts out. I kind of like to see that. I bet you would, you sadist. Um, right, so... He seems to be able to sort of go from hating our guts to wanting to talk to us all of a sudden quite quickly. Some mushrooms are edible. Probably... I'm not going to eat that. <laughs> Doesn't seem like a wise idea. Not after it's saying about some being edible. What's in here? Find something? Yep, maybe useful. Quite a lot of good tools in here, aren't there? Uh, what was that over there? Right, there's this lawnmower here. Could maybe use the blade. No? Okay. I guess we're looking in here then. Open. Oh, there it is. Barbed wire. Lots of it as well. Too. That should keep the raiders from climbing our walls. Hey, we can use these. For what? We can make bombs, bombs out of these. Yeah, bombs. Bombs? Are you serious? Nice. I totally. It's the kind of stuff I made back home. He used to blow shit up. That's why he's a troubled youth. Guilty. <laughs> I just need some propane and something to create a spark. And we'll have ourselves a nice little homemade explosive. Yeah, just use it on the bad guys, not us. Alright. I'm not going to eat this damn mushroom. Hey, what's in here? A lab. If I remember right, there's a science lab through that door. Maybe there's propane in there. Come on, help me move this thing. Alright. Let's move this. Hopefully there's no walkers in there. I bet there are going to be though, aren't there? <laughs> it's always the way. Okay, let's see what's inside. I'm guessing science stuff. Can we... Alright, so far so good. Whoa! Ugh! What the hell? It's like got plants growing off it and stuff. Rose. What's going on? You all right? We had a scare. That's all. That was gross. Uh, do they know who that is? What? Who was she? Miss Martin. 
our nurse at the school. She's dead. And how did she get tied up to there? God. She looks dead. Moldy. <laughs> it's probably a lot of words you could use there. Barely recognize her. I'm sorry, Ruby. I, I just wish I could make her look like she used to. Yeah, you can't though. <laughs> One day we came out looking for food. Walkers attacked us. Thought we could fight them off, but there were just there were so many. Ms. Martin told us to run, so we did. She taught me how to patch people up. Stitching, local anesthetics, painkillers, fever reducers. I don't hmm. think I can take care of her. Would you? I'm sorry. Yeah, it's fine. We'll do it. Why not? We can't leave her there. I'm not really sure why the game's making us do it, though. It's not like we have a choice. <laughs> that was pretty brutal. Are you okay? Yeah. Blood spraying everywhere. Just need a minute. Come on, guys. Help me find that propane and we can get out of here. All right, all right. Mr. Impatient. Right, let's take a look around. We don't want to get the propane straight away. It looks like piss. Dare you to drink it. Not in a million years. Wimp. It could be acid or anything. I ain't touching that. Uh, igniters. That might be useful. Uh, Mitch, is this useful? Fucking A. I was hoping there'd be one of those. That's an igniter. We can use it to create a spark. Now we just have to find propane. We can blast those motherfuckers to hell. Yes. Uh, right. Anything else in here? Let's talk you to Mitch seem again. You know a lot about bombs. I made my first one when I was eight. Really? Eight? I blew up the garage. It was awesome. Though, Dad didn't think it was awesome. Dad gave yeah, me I can kind of see why. Me from fighting the neighbors. Uh, why would you fight the neighbors? I had a lot of energy. I had to use it somehow. And they didn't like my face. Okay. What's this? Did you find anything? I actually I don't know what this is. Okay, there's a propane tank there, but I don't want to use that yet. I just want to have a look around. See what else we've got. <coughs> what is it? Ms. Martin meant a lot to you, huh? She was the only one who stayed. She saw us for what we were. A bunch of kids who no one wanted. She loved us when nobody else did. Like, really loved us. Yeah, I've known people like that. Sounds like she was a nice person. Her. Kind of sad that the nice people died. What's that? Venus flytrap. Is that a collectible? Looks like it. Alright. Ooh, nice. Trophy earned gatherer. <laughs> no comment on that, apparently. Oh, we also earned a trophy botanist for that, though. Which is pretty cool. Right, let's pick up this tank then. There's gas in it. Wonder if it's actually got anything in there. Apparently we can't lift this. Yeah, perfect. Here. Okay, there we go. Good, fine. Now we have everything we need. We should get back and tell the others. We have to bury Ms. Martin first. Barrier? Why bother? It's a walker. Help me drag it out back. It can burn it. No. Ms. Martin, nah, that's a bit heartless. Alive. And she deserves a proper burial here. 
Next to the greenhouse she loved. That way the others won't have to see her like this. She's been dead for years. There's no point. She deserves just a just real bury her, man. You were help you bury her. Going on about how Where heartless we you? were earlier Someone on. Someone you cared about. Thank you so much. It's not a her. It's a walker. Fine, whatever. What difference I'm does it make? My energy on that thing. <laughs> God, this guy. Honestly, just let her bury her if she wants to. It's not your problem. Alright then guys, that's where we're going to leave it for this one, on that note. Um, hopefully this guy gets brought down a level or two at some point, because it'll be for his own good I believe. But that's um, going to do it for this episode, so as always, thank you very much for watching. A big thank you to my patrons Arcades Games and Wayne for all the support, I really do appreciate it. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell if you're new, or just haven't already done so. And I'll see you all next time.